Okay, who else gets absolutely triggered by their children's school experience? I have an elementary school student. He started second grade this morning. And I realized as I was dropping him off on the blacktop for his first day of school, just how much childhood trauma I have. My heart was racing. It was beating out of my chest. I kept incessantly asking him, are you okay, buddy? Do you have everything that you need? And then when we got onto the blacktop and I saw all of the kids and their like new school day outfits with all of the parents hovering over them, my anxiety level went through the roof. And my son, my cute little second grader was like, mommy, please leave. He was one of the only few kids that like didn't want me there. He wanted me to go stand off to the side while they did the Pledge of Allegiance and this little assembly on the blacktop for the first, first day of school. He did not want me standing next to him. All the other parents were hovering over their children in line like helicopter parenting. And I'm wanting to do that. Like I'm wanting my child to want me and need me and want to hold my hand because I'm having an anxiety attack. My inner child was so triggered. But no, he banished me to the side of the blacktop with like, three other parents and we're all staring at each other in like fear and agony of like are our children going to be okay we were the ones that have the independent children like standing off to the side everybody else is standing next to their child rubbing their child's back making sure that they have everything in their backpack and all their school supplies some kids are crying some kids are literally holding their parents hand and sobbing because it's the first day of school and they don't want to leave their parents not my kid he was like don't talk to me you're embarrassing go away kid is eight okay and i'm embarrassing already so i'm standing off to the side we do the pledge of allegiance he banishes me i go up to say goodbye one last goodbye and he's like mom no uh, leave so he walks with his little line of eight-year-old students to his second grade class just fine not needing me at all meanwhile i'm skulking back to my car like on the verge of tears, having a mental breakdown. I call my husband, I'm like freaking out. My, If you think I'm talking fast now, I was talking like three times as fast on the phone with him. Like, I don't know about his outfit, I don't know about his hair, I hope he has all of his school supplies. He wasn't talking to anybody, he didn't seem to have any friends. And my, my husband's like, honey, calm. He's independent, he's doing great. We're proud of him that he doesn't need you. That is the goal. So I'm gonna say right here, if you're one of those parents that is abjectly triggered by your kids in school, you are not alone because my school experience was less than ideal. My school experience in the 80s was terrible lunch ladies walking back with that plastic tray to your table while people laugh at your outfit and then sitting down and people telling you to get up and move because they don't want you sitting with them to teachers banishing me to the corner. Did we have dunce caps in the 80s? I swear we had dunce caps. Banishing us to the corner because we were talking too much in circle time, not understanding how to do math. Do you remember in the 80s, we had literal grades in second grade. Now it's like, needs work, could use some improvement, great effort. They don't have actual letter grades. When I was eight, when I was his age, we had actual letter grades. And best be assured, your little eight-year-old girl was getting Fs, okay? And my parents would get mad at me. Like, there was no support. Like, they weren't saying, oh, you're getting Fs, honey. What can we do? Let's hire a tutor. Let's get you a therapist. Are you okay? It was like, you better shape up or ship out. Like eight year old getting an F on my report card. So school was not the best experience for me. And I may be a little bit triggered. I may need to do some inner child healing around the house saying that I do because dropping my second grader off at school today was literally a catastrophic traumatic experience.